Hi, this is Rebecca Coleman for The Art of the Business, and today I'm going to show you um, a new feature that Facebook relatively recently introduced um, that allows you to post things, but have that post show up at a different date. So you can either post it in the future, which could be quite helpful because one thing that you could do is schedule a bunch of posts and just schedule them and have them ready to go or you can backdate posts in here as well. So this is my Facebook page, um, The Art of the Business. When you scroll down, you'll see just a regular, you know, just wanna do like a regular status update. So you put it in here, um, and then what you can do is you can write on your status update, whatever you want it to be. So uh, if, for example, like one thing that I've been doing this morning, for example, was on my personal account, I was posting baby pictures of my son. And when I posted the baby pictures of my son, what I was able to do was to backdate those photos to the day that they were actually taken so that people know that I don't currently have a baby <laughs> because they were taken, you know, quite some time ago. So you can do this a couple of different ways. One thing you can do is you can click right here. It says Offer Event Plus. And one of the options that comes down for you is what's called a milestone. And what that allows you to do is that allows you to put in here when there was a milestone in your life or in your business, because this works on your personal page as well as on your business page. So um, you can say started business. Um, and then what you can do is put in 2007, December 1st. And then you can put some more information in there. You can even put photos in there of the day you started your business. And then you click Save, and it will happen on your timeline. It'll be inserted into your timeline on December the 1st, 2007, at the very, very bottom. Okay, and there it is. Okay. Um, so now I'll just show you a couple of other ways to post um, uh, status updates, both for the, for the future and for the past. So uh, one thing that you might want to do, so one, one thing that I often sometimes do is I uh, will post something for the future. So for example, I'll write a blog post and I'll publish my blog post early in the morning, but I may not want to have my blog post on my Facebook page at 7 a.m. because not that many people are on Facebook necessarily at 7 a.m. I want it to be posted during a time of the day when it's going to get more traffic, so say 11 o'clock. So what I'll do is I'll write my blog post and I'll write my blog post and I'll put the information in here and I'll say something like today's post is about um, Facebook and how to backdate or forward date posts. And then I would include the URL right here to my blog post. Then what you want to do is you want to come down here and click on this little dude right here that looks like a clock. And when you click on that, um, you get this option. And so you've got two options here. You can either go back in time. You can go back in time for as long as your blog, as long as your business has been in business, or you can go forward in time as far as a year. So what I'll often do is I'll click 2012. I'll click on today's date, which is October the 27th. And then what I'll do is I'll click it to be at, say, 11 o'clock in the morning. You can even add a minute on there if you want it to be 11.10 or 10.50. You can do that. Then all you do is you click on Schedule, and then when it's 11.10 uh, in the morning, that post will be launched onto my Facebook page.